Hello everybody. Today I'll be showing you how to uh, make your GameCube official adapter work with Zadig and Dolphin emulator, both 7840, the official Netplay build, and 9289, the most recent build from yesterday. So the official adapter is a bit different from the Flash as it can't just be used immediately when you start it up and just go. So you have to use a program called Zadig, which the address will be in the description which replaces the driver so Dolphin can recognize it in Dolphin because as of right now there's no adapter connected now the fact that you won't have anything when you go in game because there's no controller being used just a texture keyboard so to get your GameCube controller to work with it you'll want to download the newest version of Zedig which I have right here and just I'll go ahead and open it up Wait for it to load. Here we are. Have nothing here. Now we're gonna plug in the black cord of our Wii U GameCube adapter, and we're also going to plug in the GameCube controller to the first port, the far left port of the Wii U adapter, so that it um. It comes up as player one, there's no reason not to. And then once we quickly plug this in, should be good. And we list all devices. So it's going to list all the devices that it picks up, just by standard. And once you plug it in, installing device driver status. This may not work for you, as I've already installed it once before. It may come up as missing, but that's why we want to use Zedig. So we list all devices, it will refresh it, and you want to select WUP U28. And since I have already replaced the driver myself quite a few times actually in the past, it will show as Win USB. So you want to feel free to just install the driver. It will say install here, not reinstall because you, know, you want to install. You don't actually have to always check this, but I will because I'm a sheep. Feel free to reinstall. <coughs> May take a moment. The newer versions of Zadig actually tend to take longer when they replace the drivers. So let's just skip ahead here. Okay. So now once it's finished, which mine is a already at the exact version so ended up cancelling it but once it's finished you can exit out of Zadig it should be ready to be used right away you will have to restart Dolphin though because every time you make controller changes to uh, the GameCube adapter it typically has struggles to keep up so then after you're done you want to go back into GameCube adapter adapter not detected it will still say if you haven't checked this prior and if you want Rumble you can check this too so you check both of those or just one if you don't want Rumble exit out and relaunch again which for 7 8, 40 I'll show now then once you go back into uh, controllers it should say adapter detected and you should be able to launch the game and play just fine <laughs> 